Welcome. So today we're going to talk about pricing out desktop as a service. In a previous video, um, it was explained how desktop as a service is really just VDI in a cloud environment. So we're going to talk about the particular components that go into how we cost out this service. So firstly, there is an infrastructure component. This is really the servers and all the hardware that goes into this um, into this service. Obviously, when we're hosting a desktop as a service, there's lots of servers, lots of infrastructure that go into this uh, service. Secondly, there's a software layer. This includes things such as the hypervisor, operating systems, and other software layer services that we need to be able to facilitate and run the, the desktop as a service service. Next, there is other um, cost considerations, such as the labor consideration of the service provider. So service providers, like a BDI, like a BDI service, need expertise to be able to run this service. We have expertise in Citrix, we have expertise in VMware, and we have to train, we have to keep these resources up to date with the latest software, also with the latest hardware as well. So these are costs that continuously we have to keep up to date so that we can keep that infrastructure up to date and running all the time. So these costs all combined together make up what everybody commonly knows as desktop as a service. So individually, desktop as a service with all of these combined costs allows us to provide desktops, sessions, all at individual price points. This allows us to provide a price point based on vCPU, based on vRAM, this is the amount of memory and the amount of compute that we are providing, and then finally, storage. So based on this, the com combination of these three allows us to provide a fixed and a predictable price point to the user allowing them to get a monthly cost so they know based on the amount of CPU, based on the amount of RAM, and based on the amount of storage, how much their predictable price per month will be. And, and the advantage of this being in desktop as a service is that the service provider consumes all of these costs, and so to the user, this cost is predictable and fixed every month. Thank you.